Hello everybody, Wild Bill for America here with some news that will surprise nobody. The Ferguson, Missouri violence was no riot. Turns out it was a well-planned and funded domestic terrorist attack on that city. Planned and funded by the liberal left. The headlines are out today because the rioters are now protesting because they didn't get paid as promised. Now, if the facts are correct, evil people promised those looters $5,000 a month to burn and pillage. And guess what? All of the people involved are part of the Democrat Party. Surprise, surprise, surprise. America watched as blacks rampaged, burned, and killed people in Ferguson, Missouri. And now World Net Daily and Front Page Magazine are breaking the story that they were paid to do it. Now, there was information that Eric Holder used the Justice Department money to transport some of the protesters to Ferguson, but now it appears things were even more sinister than that. Who would pay for the destruction of an American city? Barack Obama's old group, ACORN. Now, ACORN was driven underground when their evil deeds were exposed by an undercover reporter. But they just changed their name and are still up to no good. And apparently, they are now an active terrorist organization, burning and killing to force their political positions. How is that any different from what Al-Qaeda does? Now, one name keeps popping up over and over when it comes to racial violence, and that is George Soros, Nazi sympathizer, America-hating billionaire, and hero to the Democrats. Apparently, he is providing millions of dollars to these homegrown terrorist organizations. It also turns out that Beyonce, the pop singer, was busy posting bail for arrested protesters so they could get back out on the streets. And now the professional city records are mad that they did all that hard work and didn't get the pay they were promised. But don't worry. Yesterday in New Jersey, Obama promised $163 million to those groups, and it's pretty clear what the money will be used for. <laughs> Gee, doesn't it make you feel tingly all over to see your tax dollars used like that? Well, I think it's time to add George Soros to the list and send the Navy SEALs out to get him. Beyonce should be arrested and appropriately charged. And it's time to start obtaining grand jury indictments against Barack Obama and his entire administration that can be dropped on their heads the day he leaves office. And American citizens all over this country better be locked and loaded and ready to defend their cities because as long as these left-wing loons are in power, you and your city are potential targets of today's Democrat Party. Welcome to Obama's America. This is Wild Bill for America. Thank you for watching, and America, bless God, again.